Ann Dixon here. Today we're doing a video from my um, in-laws house. I am a Epicure senior consultant and the fall line is being released, the fall catalog I should say, is being released September 1st. So I'm recording this video a few days in advance and I'm actually not at home so I sent all the products to myself in St. John's Newfoundland, but I, I'm gonna record it now because I want to show you because I've been eating the products and testing them before I get them on September 1st. So how this works is a new catalog for September for Canada right now in the US. Uh, you guys have one catalog. That's because you guys just launched in the US. So if you're in the US, um, you're gonna see some products that may not be in your market yet, but don't worry, by next uh, spring, it will have the same stuff which is awesome. So one thing you guys do have in the U.S. right now that Canada doesn't is this gluten-free pizza crust. So um, this is the one we're going to test out today with my kids. Gluten-free pizza crust. Um, you can make it with the sheet pans that you can also buy that are new. Um, it's a great alternative for uh, our gluten-free friends. You can make amazing pizza crust. You can make it with marinara sauce, which also you can get from Epicure. And it's super quick to make. And I hate Making pizza dough, like, I don't know, it drives me crazy. Like, it gives me anxiety, the idea of having to, like, roll it out. But this one's super easy to make. Okay, another one is caramel sauce. So this one, um, you can use in a multi-purpose pot with whipping cream and butter. And I like this one because uh, the great thing about Epicure is there's no added ingredients. There's, everything's gluten-free. I just showed you gluten-free pizza crust. And the caramel you can use on ice cream. I've seen people use it on cakes already. Lots of different uses for caramel. So that's one of the new products, brand new products that are coming. I just showed you the caramel. Sorry, I'm just going, literally going through the box so I show you guys. Okay, next we have, oh, I'm so excited about this one. This one is the shepherd's pie. This is the kosher check on the back as well. So the shepherd's pie uh, has the ingredients on the back. So if you guys are using, try to looking for busy meals on the go, this is kind of what you guys want. Um, this one, shepherd's pie is one of those uh, time consuming foods, but this one's super easy to make. Uh, water, potatoes, you can use ground beef, but obviously you can replace the ground beef with something like lentils or uh, non-dairy options. Uh, mixed vegetables, and then you use it with a steamer and it's super quick to make. Like I'm, I'm shocked at how ridiculously fast it's gonna be. Okay, sorry. I'm trying to put them in neat piles. I got my kids to sort them and then, <laughs> and then I'm gonna mix and mix everything up. This one we already ate, and I, I'm going to show you guys this one. We already ate a whole package of it, and I made mini muffins. This is gluten-free pumpkin spice loaf and muffins. So I used a uh, pumpkin puree, and I'm really, really excited for this because it was super easy to make. I made mini muffins with it. You can make a loaf too, but my kids are always hungry right after school. So the mini muffins are perfect because they're tiny, and then they're not going to waste it because it's only a few like a tiny little muffins. They're like a big muffin. They tend to like not eat the whole thing. So here's another one that's great for holidays. It's called Coco, Coco Spice. So Coco Spice Nuts. Uh, whisk in one egg white, mixed raw nuts and seasoning. So again, this is the, I'm showing you the brand new. Oops. Oh, here's the other with cinnamon spice. So I just showed you cocoa spice and cinnamon spice. So great for holiday entertaining. So I'm showing you these. Um, these are brand new products that are for the holiday fall catalog, but they're some of your, your seasonal favorites. A lot of the items um, are still there. Like you're still going to get like the Greek, Greek kits and tons of other things you're still going to get. Oops, it's on the bottom here. Sorry. Oh my goodness, my favorite one. Okay. Here it is. Last one right now. Tuna casserole. <laughs> I showed this to my kids, and Benjamin, my and my my son was like, "Oh, that looks great. Can I have it without tuna?" I was like, "Ah, yeah, that's the whole point." So, again, this was pretty easy to make. I used to make this uh, pre kit, and then I stopped because it, it's time consuming to make something big in casserole. But this is great. So you can replace your tuna, place a tuna of white beans or tofu, but um, you can use egg noodles and frozen peas, and it's again super easy to make. Um, Great for weekday meals because when back to school time starts, like you guys, are, you guys are busy. No one's got time to make this. Okay, here's another one that's great for like super busy meals when you're in a rush. Um, not in a rush, when you have lots of time, speedy lasagna it takes forever to make. Um, regular lasagna makes for, takes forever, but speedy lasagna will be faster. You have to use it with the multi purpose, you can use it with the multi purpose steamer, um, ground meat sauce, and again, really easy to make. Like. I was watching the instructional video. It's, it's, I'm impressed at how fast this one is. So, uh, 
that's one of the new favorites. So uh, that's it for me. I'm going to just pause the video and then um, hope you guys are doing great. And let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.